and these are not slouch opponents that they are going against. Laurent in the game, finding some room with a spin and laying it in. He has a chance at the next level of talking to NBA scouts who secretly like him. Three good for DeZagua. Scoring the game for the Cowboys. Two to shoot, long three, Fuller. Got rim. Offensive rebound. Missed by Smith. Third opportunity is there for Samuel. Count it and one. And then contrarily, Oklahoma State is having trouble rebounding in the zone. Samuel cleaning things up. I to shoot, and Nay shoots over Ladee, but can't get it to the rim. Good defense by Ladee. Long pass. Fuller to the rim, but there's Ladee to clean it up. Boy, Ladee, great on both ends. How about that? Get likely in pick and roll. You've got to get help because he's a dangerous scorer coming off the screen. Keelan Boone, his second three of the game. I guess the shoulder's not feeling too badly. And good patience by Likely. Crosses over, trying to take it, adjust the shot uh, due to the length of Samuel and got it to fall as the shot clock was expiring. Kane with the crossover, nice feed and a slam by Samuel. Especially when you have opportunities like that with no one around you. Griff picked up his third foul at the end of that play. Here's a Bane three, got it. A good offensive first half. Oklahoma State needed that. They needed a Laurent easy one and a land. Well, a nice little Euro step. Second in possession. First, a nice drive with Nimhart. Lost the dribble. It's loose. Nimhart had it for a moment again. It's flying in the air. And here's Likely. Doesn't have numbers. And he's going to slow it down, but give it to Desiree. He's going to drive. Kiss. Good. Create enough. Space with the step back is off the mark with the shot. Likely racing in, the kiss again, and Likely going downhill. They lay up, didn't they? They're getting them one, two, three, and OSU. And off to Likely. The Zog was long three. Yep. Coach Dixon wanted a jump ball, but they not. Chasing hard with Dezagua, he gets some space. I mean, they beat some good teams, be the Syracuse team, and were beating teams by double-digit figures. I mean, they were really good, and then all of a sudden, they fell off the map. TCU will drop to 13 and nine overall, and four and five in conference. And TCU now going to be taking on Kansas on Saturday, having lost four straight and six of their last seven.